someone is dealing with something that is very unexpected. This is why something has been closed off. Someone's trying to protect something that you may not know. This is someone who needs to do the shadow work and they're trying to take it slow with bringing you a truth. Someone knows they should have compromised with you. Now they feel like something is on pause. This energy feels like there's some type of timeout or this energy feels like this situation was more of a a temporary solution. Someone didn't feel like they were, really, they were gonna be locked out for good. I feel this is someone who still has passion for you. They feel like they need to step up, spice something up because they know that you are worth the time. This is someone who has wasted a lot of time believing something was gonna always be there with you. Yet now they're realizing how much they should have shown you the respect and love you deserve. This is someone who wants to reconcile. They want to grow. They want to be with you. But I also feel this energy is starting from the ground up because of how toxic they have been. As I said before, this is someone who thought this was temporary. They thought that you would possibly wait. I also feel many of you were waiting on an apology just that just never came. This is another reason why something was closed to them. And they regret now not making something right. Because now they're dealing with something that is over their head or way too toxic. Whatever this is, is very unhealthy and unbalanced. There is some trauma, there is some abuse, and someone is wanting to escape the flames. I feel like this is someone who is trying to weather the storm. This is someone who is going through a lot because they took a risk. Wow. Someone is wishing they never took this risk because it closed the door to you. Something that was unexpected has caused them not to see something for what it is. Caused them not to grow. Now this energy is doing the shadow work. They're taking something so, but something is still toxic. This is someone who is wanting to reconcile with you, but they feel like something is on pause. Something is delayed, but they're also feeling like they hope you still have time or energy for them after what they've done because they feel like you're no longer giving them unconditional love. This is someone who took a risk on something that was unconditional because they felt like they needed the space. This energy wanted to be single. Wow. Now they're dealing with some legal matters. Someone needed space. This energy thought that they needed time away to see the truth about something, but I feel this energy took too much time to do that. This is why something has been delayed or on, a, on the final leg or no longer on the fast track. This is someone who is trying to weather through the storm, but they feel alone. They feel like they're fighting something on their own. This is someone who wanted to be single, wanted to be out of a commitment, so they let go. Someone let go or release their position because they were in denial when it comes to an illusion. This energy was in denial when it comes to an illusion or a third party, even a friendship that they thought was solid, but it only ended up breaking hearts and breaking trust. I feel like this energy broke the trust when they gave into some type of illusion, denying and avoiding the truth. This energy let go of the wrong person to give into a third party energy. This is an out outside interference, a karmic energy. Please take it how it resonates, but this energy definitely saw this person as a friend, someone they thought they could trust. And this is why they wanted to be single or wanted to find their own way. So they broke the trust with family. They broke the trust with you and now they regret it. Someone regrets bringing it in all of this drama and chaos because they were wearing a mask in a situation wanting to be accepted by the wrong energies. This energy was just looking for the attention. And now that they have it, they feel like it's not what they want. I feel this is someone who just wanted more. And now they're trying to rewrite this story, rewrite what has been done because they feel like they've learned a lesson. Someone feels like they learned a lesson when it comes to this union. 
There's a lot of anxiety and something has taken place that is very unexpected. There could be some legal issues here. Someone's going through a lot of conflict, fire and ice energy here. Or this could be the energy of fire, water. You could be dealing with Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Sagittarius, Leo, Aries. Please take it how it resonates. But someone knows they need to travel your way. Someone is realizing opposites do not attract, but they didn't see this coming. Something affected their happiness and their peace, and this is why they're wanting to travel your way, because there is a karmic lesson to be learned. Someone is learning something in a very difficult way because of the path that they chose. I feel like this is someone who was repeating cycles in a situation, and they had to learn the hard way when it comes to a commitment, their peace of mind, happiness not being in denial when it comes to the truth or even a third party let's get some more energy here wow this energy was in a delusion or some type of denial when it comes to affairs of the heart when it comes to love I sense when it comes to affairs of the heart or love someone took the wrong path when it comes to family because whatever path they took they couldn't grow Someone ghosted a, a soul contract. There is no contact with this energy because they lost their way. This is why they're trying to weather the storm and they're feeling alone in it. I feel something unpredictable happened here that caused this energy to let go. Someone didn't expect you to close the gate. But this energy needed time to grow. Someone needed time to understand who and what you are because there is nothing else like you. I feel this energy was in a deep space of denial when it comes to a soul contract. This is why they were careless when they, they broke the trust, when they parted away from family. Because these energies they gave into, they were not their friend. These are the lessons they needed to learn. Someone needed to learn a valuable lesson about wasting their time, throwing things away that are purposeful to their journey for something that is lackluster in life. This is someone who gave into something that was only supposed to be short term. And now they have legal issues. I feel these legal issues were unexpected. This is why the conflict is here. Someone is not wanting you to know what they're dealing with. For some of you, this could be a pregnancy or some type of loss in a job or money but someone's foundation has been shaken please take it how it resonates but i also feel this energy has a lot of anxiety building up this energy is definitely in the mood beside themselves when it comes to a commitment or a union because they've caused too much damage too much chaos this is someone who now feels weighed down by what they go they're going through trying to get their wits about themselves. They're trying to find some type of peace, but there is no peace wherever they are. Wow. This is someone who is definitely tied down. Someone wishes they never took the chance on letting something be with you because now they feel stressed, weighed down. They feel like the world is on their shoulders because they're taking on too much too much responsibility. I feel there's too much responsibility when it comes to finances. Someone was pretending. Wow. Someone was pretending something wasn't as bad as it was, but this is part of the denial when it comes to an illusion, a third party. Someone didn't want to see someone or something for what it was. Now something unexpected they didn't see coming has them seeing something or someone for their true colors. Because trust me, it's a hot mess, and someone is wishing they never cut ties with you. Someone is wishing they never cut the communication, or someone wishes they listened to you when you spoke or you warned them, because now they're dealing with a lot. Things are a hot mess, chaotic. I definitely feel reflection is needed, because someone is isolated. Someone is isolated because there's a lot of tension and arguments surrounding them. And for many of you, this energy is checked out in many ways when it comes to a third party. I feel this third party is angry all the time. There's a lot of yelling. There's a lot of screaming. And this energy is trying to isolate themselves from the hot mess. They're reflecting. 
but I feel they're still paranoid about their insecurities, about what you know. Someone is tired of pretending. It's starting to weigh them down. I feel someone is feeling strapped to a situation because of financial support, codependency. But I feel this energy has isolated themselves because they don't want you to see how heartbroken they truly are. Someone is definitely sitting in a space where they're going through hard times. This is someone who is having a hard time being away from you because they feel like it's going to be impossible to come back your way. Especially since the dust has settled. They're starting to see they just can't simply get over you. Because they're starting to see clearly when it comes to those they chose to trust. I feel like this energy is tired of pretending. So they've isolated themselves to repair their heart. They feel like they've learned some lessons when it comes to a third party and they're trying to get away from it. Someone is trying to go no contact when it comes to a friendship. Wow. They're wanting to be isolated. This energy is alone and sad. There's some bitter feelings here, but I feel it's less towards you and towards those that they are surrounded by because not only are they having to hide their energy or the feeling of being depressed, they're also hiding the fact that they're wanting to come back towards you. They're just hoping you still have love for them or after all they've done, after they pull back their energy. But I also feel this energy is hoping you still care after they pull back the veil on this illusion. Because I sense this energy left something to mystery for too long. Now there could be some unhealed trauma, addictions, mental issues, because someone is feeling trapped. Trapped and alone and not sure how to get out of this mess. This could be a lack of control or someone feeling like they're in a mental prison. This energy feels like they're losing themselves in a situation that was only supposed to be short term. Now they're feeling like something is dead for good or won't be redeemed. Someone feels like this is the final breakup. This is earth energy. Someone feels like they can't ground themselves. Air energy is feeling reckless. Things are moving too fast. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Please take it how it resonates with your message. But this energy feels like there's an imbalance when it comes to love. An imbalance when it comes to a counterpart, karmic, third party. Someone is feeling like they need to cleanse their energy. They just hate the fact that they just let something be. Someone didn't compromise with a divine energy. You. Yeah. This energy is feeling like you are the yin to their yang. They're dreaming about you. They're trying to stay calm about the innocence. The children. Please take it how it resonates. Someone feels like they should have been in a space of satisfaction with you. But this energy took a chance. Took a chance because they thought... They have the options. Yet I also feel something is coming soon. I feel something is near. Something is unexpected when it comes to the connection with you. Someone is wanting to take a risk. And this looks like this looks like a big risk. Someone is wanting to make a risk towards you, and I feel like that is definitely coming soon because they do see you as their happiness. Someone is now seeing offices do not attract. And they regret the fact that they had to go through all of this to see it this is someone who has learned some karmic lessons because they were repeating cycles yet they are now wanting to travel towards you but they're hoping that you don't use their loyalty against them the fact that they did something disgusting or unforgiving caused all of this drama and chaos for nothing especially when it comes to the union you once had I feel there's a lot of anxiety when it comes to thinking about reconciling with you because they don't know where this could go. They don't know if this could start another fight. Yet this energy does want to rewrite something with you because all of the regret. This energy wants to open up, reveal, and talk to you to cause something to be long term. But I feel this energy is just wondering if they should stay where they at. There's a lot of grief and sadness and this energy feels like you won't get over what they did. You won't get past it. You'll never be the same. And they could be thinking about you so often. They're always watching. Always waiting. 
someone is always waiting this energy knows they don't have nine lives they're trying to focus on rebuilding revamping their life because without a doubt they know you are the missing piece this is someone who hopes a separation with you isn't final because there are so many things they know needs to be said that you may not want to hear yet I sense they're taking this leap of faith to finally admit you were right about something or someone or even everything. I just wish they didn't let this ride out as long as they did. Someone is in a deep conflict. They're trying to get through the tension in a third party situation someone is realizing they don't have no clue who they're dealing with someone thought that they could be accepted or chosen someone was really prideful about that thinking that they had more choices but i sense it only backfired this may also be why they keep their intentions for you private as many around them don't want you to have your victory yeah, I sense with or without this energy, you're going to win regardless. I feel like this energy could be keeping things private because many already know how you're going to feel about the truth. Because this truth will make a lot of people uncomfortable as they know they had a hand in a lot of the damage. This is why many of them are very insecure. These energies are wanting to be secure within a situation, but they're guarded. Someone knows their hand in the situation, and they're stressed about it. Someone's stressed because they know they are attached. So, I feel like these energies are rooted in a situation. And they're attached in many ways. This is what's keeping this person guarded to the situation. But someone needs to speak up and speak out. Because I feel they're doing more damage with their silence. This is someone who is wanting to secure their space in your life. But they feel lost because they know they brought you a lot of disappointment. This is someone who is numb. Numb because of the conflict, the arguments, the pain, and the broken trust. I feel there's broken trust in so many ways when it comes to a friendship or what they thought would be a friendship or a close bond because it's all falling apart. Someone's true colors are definitely starting to show and they're disgusted. This energy is disgusted, hesitant, and isolated. This energy is trying to numb the pain of the fact that they feel lost and sad, guarded in a situation that is only stressing them out. Someone feels like they destroyed their roots. They destroyed their foundation for something that never should have taken place, something that should have never been a part of their life. And now they're insecure and hoping for change. This is someone who is feeling like they need to do something very radical or unexpected when it comes to this situation all because of how distant and lost that they were towards you. But I feel many of them surrounding this energy is really trying to delay that process because they don't want the energy. They don't want the hate towards them because of what they've done to this connection. These third party energies are very in their head about their own survival, in their head about you not finding out their hand in this mess. But something is about to refresh just so something can grow. This is someone who has wish fulfillment when it comes to you because they know they threw away their position for their lustful ways. Now they want to expose what is hidden. They're no longer wanting to be independent. Now this energy is obsessed, even though they abandoned you. Many of you, you're very suspicious of this energy, suspicious of their happiness, suspicious of the fact that they may be faking something. But I also feel this energy is coming out of, out of hiding because they feel stuck, blocked. Things have been silent for too long. I feel like this energy ignored you on a big level. They kept a lot of secrets because they were rebelling or being defiant. Now they're conflicted. 
This energy is conflicted and tired of the mess that they're in. And they're starting to feel like they have no choice but to surrender or put a little water on the damage. Someone is knowing they got to put this fire out themselves. But I feel this energy has been in denial for so long, they just can't help but feel sad about their situation. But I feel them feeling like they have no way out is causing all the stress. They're just trying to repair a broken heart, which may be their very own. For many of you, I feel like this energy is sad, overwhelmed, detached, even angry. Because they have realized something. I feel like someone's realized something about a third party and they're no longer confident. Confident in self or a situation, this energy is finding it hard to be optimistic. Well, optimistic. In fact, I feel like this energy is regretful, tired, and embarrassed because they gave up. Now something is out of control and they feel like they were misled. This energy feels like they were misled in a situation and now they're feeling embarrassed because they gave up on what they have with you too soon. Others are like throwing this in their face. This could be friends or fake friends who are making them feel worse about lo losing you and they're tired of their environment. This energy is tired and regretful and feeling embarrassed about their situation because they know they were misled by third parties. These are energies that never had their best interest at heart, but this energy had no clue. They couldn't see that until it all blew up in their face. Um, this energy is feeling misled, manipulated, and they're bitter because of it. This energy is frustrated because they feel like they've been cut off, overlooked, and defeated. This energy is feeling tired and defeated, regretful because they are overlooked and embarrassed because of the man manipulation. I feel this energy gave up because they were misled and now things are out of control and they're feeling disgusted. This energy is finding it hard to find some type of peace or silver lining in the situation because they don't feel loved where they are. This energy don't feel the love and they feel all the tension, they feel all the stress. And they're also realizing what you were talking about. Because now they're upset. Someone's truly upset because they feel like they were used as a pawn in an even bigger game. That's only left them annoyed, frustrated, and they trust no one. This is someone who is very emotional because of who they chose to trust because now they feel used and they're very upset and annoyed because now there's no love, there's no peace, and there's no serenity. Now this energy feels like they need to detach from their weaknesses, their desires, or the fact that someone is in their ear. This energy still has a lot of love for you. They still have a lot of hope for this connection and they feel they should touch your heart or try to reconnect with you, but this energy is feeling vulnerable in ways, somewhat shy. Not wanting to stand out, this energy is trying to stay calm by not opening up to those around them because being with you is a little more than they can handle. This energy knows they need to be bold, but they're surrounded by jealousy. This energy is trying to get a new perspective on life, but they feel hopeless and vulnerable, helpless, trapped. But I feel for many reasons, they're ready. They're ready to find something with you or repair something with you, but they're also scared. Scared of some type of tower moment or something that they feel will destroy something for good. I feel like this is something that can be exposed or revealed and they're annoyed and embarrassed by something coming out someone wants to tell you first wow whatever this is can potentially hurt you the truth hurts but this energy wants to be free they're drowning in it this energy knows they should have been grateful for what they had because had they been grateful for the connection with you they would have never gotten themselves into this yet this is what they're dealing with and trust me it's a hot mess because they're not carefree their feelings smothered, conflicted, and rebellious. This energy knows the secrets that they have or destroying them. 
and they should have not ignored what you did or what you said because the silence is starting to break them and for many of you this energy wants you to unblock them this is someone who is feeling stuck they can't be happy but i feel many of you are too suspicious because this in this energy abandoned you in the worst way i feel like this energy is starting to become obsessed obsessed with being independent or speaking on something that is hidden I feel like this energy put themselves in a situation where their weaknesses were, were amplified, their insecurities were elevated, and now they want to grow out of it. They want to grow from this and have a fresh start. Someone knows that the damage they caused with you was serious, but this energy didn't see that in the beginning. They didn't see all of the things that they were doing to you would add up in the long run because this energy only ended up hurting themselves in the process. Now this energy is upset, annoyed, feeling like they are being used within a situation and they regret overlooking you or even the signs and warnings that they ignored because now they feel they're cut off. And for some of you, they haven't told everybody. They're hiding that fact that the fact that you have cut ties with them. However, for those that do know, they're not making them feel great about it. Someone is starting to get disgusted by what or who they're dealing with. They're realizing how fake something really is. Let's get some more. Someone's thinking about why. Why was I so attracted to this third party or environment? Why, why did I risk it all for this? Someone is in their head asking themselves why. <sighs> yeah, they're stuck in the past. Someone is stuck in the past. They can't get their head around something. Someone knows they lost themselves in a situation by doing too much. Now they're fearing something with you will never be recovered. Someone's trying to block out the haters. They're trying to gain some type of confidence to come your way. But I also feel someone's gonna be playing a bit of a victim. This energy is playing cat and mouse in some type of way, but this is another reason why they've lost themselves in the bullshit. I feel this energy is still holding on, but I also feel they're still doing too much. This is why you are suspicious or not really tapping into their energy because it's always something like this. This energy will clear something up and then make something worse. This is someone who is stuck in the past about criticizing you or not taking you seriously. Someone's realizing everything you did and everything you said was out of love. This is why someone is still holding on because nothing that they're getting now is comparing to what you have given. Wow, this energy is no longer wanting to be the victim in a situation, but I feel this energy is always setting themselves up to fail. Yet I sense this time, it's just a little harder to get out of that, that certain energy. They're still trying to weather the storm, but I sense it's also causing them to be stagnated. Someone's believing something will fix itself, but this is someone who needs to move with intention if they ever think this is going to change. Because I don't see you fixing something you never broke. Someone is needing to step up and make things right. Someone is needing to right their wrongs. But in so many ways, this energy feels like it's going to be too hard. This energy feels like it's going to be too hard because of what they lost or how they broke your heart. I feel this energy is surrounded with something or someone where there's no real stability. It's just lust, not love. It's just eye candy. I also feel someone is being body shamed. Someone's gained a lot of weight. Or someone is shaming them for something they can't change. Even their intellect. Someone's being a bully. They're feeling rejected and broken. I also feel someone is breadcrumbing them, taking more than they need, leaving them with the breadcrumbs. Whoever and whatever this is, they're not being themselves. Someone's not being themselves in this situation. They're just being cold towards this energy because they can. Now they're realizing they should have never took this risk because now you may be unavailable. Wow, I feel like this energy gave way too much. Got way too little for this situation. Now someone regrets cheating. 
this energy is in a place of being very indecisive because they feel like making amends with you will be very demanding. Someone feels like they're no longer your type. You're going to reject them. But I feel in so many ways this energy is still too attached. This energy believes love is the answer. This energy believes love is the answer and they're trying not to procrastinate about it but I feel they're, they're in the energy of feeling like they are unworthy. They feel unworthy and they're still sitting in a space of addictions. But I also feel this energy is love sick over you. This is someone who needs you in the worst way. They're also dealing with past trauma. But someone knows if they don't move now and truly make a compromise, they may lose you forever. I feel this is someone who is sitting in a space of confusion because they they feel like everyone leaves. This is why they walked away from you before you can walk away from them, but I feel like you're not that energy. You would, They were dealing with someone they never encountered before. This energy feeling like you are like everyone else. This is how they feel. This is where the failure started. You are very unique and you're nothing like anyone else. There's no good ones left. Someone's being very passive about you, not committed to this situation. You have to set some boundaries because dealing with them and affairs of the heart, it was just too much work. You had to retreat. Now this energy is wanting to rush in, feeling like you're the only one. But I feel someone's going to have to prove that, not just say that, because many of you are now guided by your heart. This energy has a lot of insecurities, and they go back and forth a lot. But they also have a fear of being alone or being without you. But I also feel they're dealing with some self-hate or self-neglect. Someone is sitting in a space of confusion, being breadcrumb and giving too much in return. Someone is regretting the fact that they took a risk because now what they had with you may be lost. This is someone who is going through a lot, hiding their feelings, hiding their emotions, being needy. Wow, someone definitely thought love was the answer. And now they feel like you're being passive or retreating or hiding your feelings. Not wanting to be vulnerable. Wow. So I definitely feel someone could be hiding their feelings because they're dealing with someone who is very needy. This is a third party energy who has left them feeling very vulnerable. This is why they're making excuses not speaking on a real truth. Someone knows speaking on you is just too much. Someone can't handle that. So they become detached, unsocial. This energy feels like I don't want anyone else to get hurt, but there's a lot of people getting hurt in the process. So they're guarding something. They're guarding their heart. They're guarding their thoughts, their emotions, because they know wherever they are, they're just not compatible with the situation. Someone knows they settled. Now, for many of you, they need help, needing to be rescued from a situation they created because now they feel burnt out. Something is definitely incomplete without you. Someone realizes they moved too soon. Wow, they should have never stayed complacent in a situation or in a situation there where there's just a web for the lies because they know they can't change those around them. Someone knows they can't tolerate this abuse anymore because they're starting to feel unloved. I feel this energy was not satisfied so they were seeking a sense of perfection. And now they feel like they're being judged or they're going through judgment for walking away. As I said before, you guys, this is someone who feels like there's a lot of things unsaid, but I also feel they've said a lot of things that are not true. Now they're feeling like they're fated to be alone, fated to be in this mess because of all the games they played. Now they're feeling like the lone wolf. Someone who is bound to be alone. I feel there's a lot of mixed signals in this situation and this energy has a lot of pent-up anger because they're not expressing 
what they see, what they feel. They're too de codependent on those around them. They know that if they express what they're thinking and feeling, they can take a big loss. Someone's not ready for that. This is why there's a lot of mixed signals. You don't feel like this person is changing at all, but they are. They're just not talking about it. This is someone who is very anxious. There's a lot of anxiety and they're trying to keep themselves busy. Because deep down they know they can't fix this. They can't fix this unlovable situation, this toxic situation, I feel, for many reasons. This is why they procrastinate. This is why they're silent. This is why they're not talking. Someone has become very needy when it comes to their situation. Very needy or dependable or dependent on their energy. And even if they have very little, whoever they're dealing with, it seems like a lot. Someone has very low expectations. I feel for many of you, this energy discarded you or left you because they went to a weaker situation. There was less stress. There was less of a demand on their energy. Someone required less growth. Someone didn't have to grow in the environment that they're in, but this is the very reason they're now stuck. I sense this is someone who invested in people who was only playing a role instead of stepping into a role. Yet I sense they couldn't put on this act for too long. Someone couldn't put on this act forever as these energies who claim to be authentic and real never really clarified or specified the meaning of that. As I sense, these energies should come with a disclaimer because the only real I see is real petty and real phony. As many of these energies have no clue what being authentic really is. This is why someone is still stuck in a situation where they're still trying to weather the storm. There's a lot of shame, there's a lot of embarrassment, and someone is completely tired. This energy is feeling defeated, knowing they need to make something right with you. They just don't know how to make it make sense. As the choices they have made are definitely senseless. Yet this energy is looking to ascend. This energy is looking to grow because they know their heart is really with you. Yeah, something is definitely obvious. Someone could be observing. There's bad behaviors from both ends when it comes to the third party and this other energy. Yeah, I also feel like this chemistry is off. This energy is seeking transformation because they know the vibes are off. There's a lot of mess going around. There's a lot of talk. And I feel this energy is really realizing how dysfunctional something else is. Because they know the chemistry with you was way different. Even though you pushed them to grow, I feel that was necessary. Because this energy has a lot of misogynistic tendencies or very childish tendencies. And this is why they needed this time to grow. Because they always... They always ended up hurting you in the process of their damaging or their mistakes or their lustful ways. The fact that they were weak to a situation or not realizing not everybody is who or what they say they are. And I sense this is someone who just needed to learn the hard way. And trust me, they have more on deck than they can handle. This is why this energy is trying to take it slow. They're trying to observe what their next move should be. They're also trying to hide that next move because every time they present something to someone, someone tends to delay the progress or the process, bringing them more stress or causing them to fumble in some type of way. This energy is now realizing the energies they've chosen to be around just might be their enemy or even a wolf in sheep's clothing. Because for many of you, this energy is now over it. They're over the illusion. They're over the lies. And they're tired of trying to numb the pain. Well, especially when it comes to influences or addictions. Someone who is sitting in a space where something is out of touch or shocking. But whatever the case, I feel like this is someone who is trying to play it cool trying to pretend they're not so attached 
when it comes to a situation they stay mute about, they stay silent about. I feel this energy was trying to play it cool when it comes to a third party or a karmic influence. This energy was just trying to fit in. So, they created this false persona. This is why many of you have no clue who this person is. Not at this point. A lot of things have just faded away because they took a chance and looked past you. This energy took a chance and looked past you because they wanted more. This caused them to put on a performance of a lifetime when it comes to community ties. This energy was trying to laugh off the disrespect or the fact that they were feeling attacked. So they just numb out the pain. This energy numbed out the pain, blocking things out, but I feel this energy is now starting to read between the lines when it comes to a distraction or just wanting to escape. This energy is looking for the exit. This energy is looking for the exit, but they're needing to heal their heart chakra because this energy is definitely getting those around them just throwing shade. But I also feel what they had with you was otherworldly. But they are influenced by addictions. But they also know nothing else compares. They wish, they wish for you and they dream for you. But there is still some sort of fantasy or illusion that needs to be spoken about. I feel whatever this is, is causing them to feel a bit worse or they feel like they're dying inside. Someone feels like they need to speak out before things get to a place where it can't be recovered. I feel like this energy feels like they went down a rabbit hole, a dark rabbit hole by holding a grudge or being petty towards you because these other energies had some dark intentions that they couldn't see. Now they regret cutting you off or pushing you away, cutting you out because it only blinded them to the confusion. This is someone who made a lot of promises. Then they decided to go solo. But I feel you had to rise above it. You had to rise above this situation even though it was very petty and it truly broke your heart because this came from nowhere. This energy was one way, one minute, and the next, this energy was focusing on something else, focusing on an illusion. And this is why they side away from affairs of the heart with you. This is someone who needs to clean up their act and see the signs to level up, but I feel they're still hiding in the shadows. Someone is regretting the fact that they put you in a position where you have to protect your heart or your energy because they're not in a place of respect when it comes to the community they're now surrounded in. Things are way different and they regret settling for something or someone else. Someone regrets wanting more because they should have been satisfied with what they have. Now all that they just lost this energy thinks about that. They think about what they could have been had they listened to you. Had they not stayed muted. This energy is definitely trying to focus because they know that uh, some type of secret is coming out. Something is going to be exposed regardless and they're wanting to meet up with you. This energy is wanting to talk to you about a third party. They could be watching you from a distance and they're feeling attacked by a third party or karmic influence. They feel like someone is trying to bully them. They're trying to ignore it, but the more they try to fit in and ignore it, the worse it gets game on. Someone is in the fast lane and they're wanting to take things slow. They're wanting to get out of this toxic situation or this situation that has become a mess but I feel the damage is already done. Especially when it comes to an illusion because someone's been numbing the pain for so long. Something just got worse. Something got worse because of their weaknesses and lustful ways. Someone took advantage of this energy. Took advantage of of the fact that this energy wasn't as smart or as confident or they didn't have their own but I definitely feel someone took advantage of that now they're in deep regret because of it and this energy is tired of being away from you because of who or what they've allowed to put between the two of you as they see something or someone wasn't even worth the time 
wasn't even worth the energy. Yet I sense the more they stick around, trying to ride something out, the harder it will be to make amends with you. As it seems, they hesitate because they know how much they hurt you, which makes things so much more complicated because they know what they have to say to you after all of what they've done because you don't know everything. This energy feels like what they need to say that makes it just that hard to reveal because of what they know they've done in the past. And this energy knows they have taken you for granted too many times. This one just might be the last. Someone knows that they took something too far, especially by holding this grudge. I sense holding this grudge only took them to a darker space, deeper down the rabbit hole. Now they feel like they need to speak up because they're dying inside when it comes to a fantasy or an illusion and their wish fulfillment is just you. Because as I said before, no one else compares. This energy is wanting to come out of this space. This energy is all in their head about it. They dream of you. They think of you often. And I also feel the nerves are starting to kick in, especially when it comes to influences and addictions. This is someone who is wanting to release. This energy is wanting to surrender. This energy is starting to understand the truth, especially when it comes to these third parties or hidden dangers or even these karmic cycles because they're now realizing it's just a losing game. A losing game they were never built to win. Now this energy is praying, hoping, trying to manifest, seeking forgiveness because they know what they had with you was rare. This is someone who knows what they had with you was rare, yet they're not thinking that you see them in a different space. This is why they're hiding in the shadows, but I feel you had to rise above it to keep your sense of sanity because you was always waiting for change. They just never gave it to you. Someone knows they should have listened because had they listened, they would have never lost their way. Yeah, because of the history of this relationship, they're hoping that you see something in a different light. Someone is hoping you find the heart to hear them out. As they know, many of the things they've done cannot be unseen, unheard, or even undone. They're just hoping they didn't destroy the side of you that still cares. <laughs>